بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم ما بعد Believing in Allah and the pillars of Iman are an obligation in Islam and to complete one's Islam sometimes simple deeds such as giving salams to your brothers and sisters in Islam can help gain you forgiveness create love between you as a believer and strength strengthen the brotherhood and make someone's day perhaps or brighten their day make them feel good make them feel good about themselves make them feel good about being a believer all this are just some simple results of spreading salams between one another عن أبي هريرة رضي الله تعالى عنه قال قال رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم والذي نفسي بيدي لا تدخل الجنة حتى تؤمنوا ولا تؤمنوا حتى تحابوا أو لا أدلكم على شيء إذا فعلتموه إذا إذا فعلتموه تحببتم أفشوا السلام بينكم رواه مسلم the Prophet ﷺ said that by the one whose hands his soul is in, by the one whose hand his soul is in, that one of you will not enter paradise until he believes. Letting us know Iman is first. You have to have Iman Billah. Having believe in the pillars of Iman. So one of you will not enter paradise until he believes. And none of you will believe until he loves. And then he said, Should I show you a thing that if you did it, it will cause you to love one another? And then he replied, it was a rhetorical question, he said, Give salams between you. You know, give one another salams. Say salamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. So it shows us the importance of greeting and strengthening the, the ties of brotherhood and love between the believers. And that, that is mashroor. That is something legislated in the sharia. It's something we're encouraged to do. And that's a part of iman is giving salams to one another, spreading the, the, the greetings of a believer. And loving one another is a part of Iman as well. It's a part of Kamil Iman, how to complete your Iman, make your Iman, take it to another level. But if you don't do this, that does not mean you have no Iman. That means your Iman is deficient. So this is the state of the believer. This is the case of the believers that we want to strive to increase our iman. We want to strive to give salams to one another and encourage one another and spread love between one another. And think about it yourself. Whenever you're in a place, maybe a strange place where there are no Muslims and you see a, a believer and they're not hiding from you, but rather they actually greet you. Assalamu alaikum. You feel good. You feel like, mashallah, this person is not hiding. We're sharing the beauty of belief or the beauty of iman together that's the state of the believer that's the this the characteristic of the believer and we ask that Allah the Almighty accepts our good and forgives our evil sallallahu alaihi wasallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wasallam